What's up, everyone? It's Saturday, July 17th, 2021, 82 Fahrenheit, 28 Celsius, and it's 3.12 in the afternoon at the Griffith Observatory. This observatory is on the slope of Mount Hollywood in Los Angeles' Griffith Park. As you can see, it's a very popular tourist attraction. One of the reasons being that sign over there, the Hollywood sign, which is still a little bit far away from this angle. But the Griffith Observatory is notorious for showing a lot of space and science related um, exhibits. And Griffith's legacy was to make this observatory free for all who entered. Ever since 1935, this observatory has been free to enter. But we'll go inside and I'll go through the various terraces and show you excellent views of Los Angeles. Here it is, the Griffith Observatory. If you're coming to visit Los Angeles, I believe this is a must visit just due to all the views. Here it is, the entranceway to the Griffith Observatory. There's a pendulum over here. Really interesting. And various halls here. This one's the Hall of the Sky. Here we have space exhibits and the planetarium. And over here is Hall of the Eye, where you can actually view through the telescope through most um, nights, starting from, I think, 7 o'clock p.m. Here's the founders of the observatory, Griffith. who made this park and observatory possible. Cardinal Griffith loved astronomy. It was intended to provide an unobstructed view of the sky with free public telescopes. Okay, let's go towards the Hall of the Sky. There's public restrooms to the left and right of me. Over here you can learn about the different phases of the moon. All from new moon to full moon and then back to new moon again. How day and night works around the world. Sun and star pathways. Different eclipses relating to the sun, the earth, and the moon, as well as the seasons, different equinoxes and the solstices. Here's the Hall of the Sky as well as 
the whole um, periodic table, different elements. That's cool. Wow, they even have like the radioactive elements here, I think. Yeah. <laughs> like, how do you know? Like, how do you make them stable? Right? I know. <laughs> I haven't even heard of some of these things. Curium, Berkelium, Californium, Einsteinium, <laughs> Lawrenceium. Uh, there's lead. Lead, I know, is one of the uh, most dense elements. They use that for a lot of like protection. This is cool. Some of these things look empty. Yeah, maybe they left it empty because it's so uh, unstable. Uranium. Oh my gosh, they have uranium. Ooh. But the most important element, I think, is uh, carbon. Carbon is like 80% of the elements. Active sun. Satellite views of the sun. Wow, look at that. So you look through here, see? Look at that, huh? Look through there, I know it smells like, um, but it's brass. You see it? Yeah, I see the red dots. Well, that's the sun. That's how the sun is. You can see the sun there. Wow, I gotta look through this now. Let's wait in line. These instruments operate only when the sun is out. The spectral helioscope. Wow. Let's take a look. Wow, that's interesting. I don't think you can make it out though. Hard to see. Okay. All right, so this is the West Terrace where we'll be able to see striking views all of Los Angeles. Over there is the downtown Los Angeles skyline. And then we'll just pan over to the right. Sweeping views all of the metropolitan area. I believe over there is the skyline of Century City. It's okay to glance at it. And just as the last piece of it is about to be set on. There's also a dining level here. There's the Hollywood sign again. There's also an upper level to this observatory.
right, let's see the rest of these halls. Okay, so the planetarium looks like it's closed. Well, maybe you need tickets to get in. Gone through the depths of space exhibits. This goes back to the East Terrace. I guess we're going downstairs at this point. Well, that's a beautiful picture with the Griffith Observatory background. Wow, there's a theater down there and the cafe. Gunther Deaths of Space Exhibits. They're giving the story of the birth of the universe, Big Bang Theory, Milky Way. Let's see where this takes us. Definitely a very nice spiral. Whoa, I did not expect to see a hall like this over here. This is super cool. California meteorites. That's pretty neat. Cloud chamber. Beautiful display of the different planets of the solar system. Close up of the moon. I think after this, we just have the lower terrace and the other side for us to explore. Big picture. What else is around here? Wow, they have a station for each planet. This guy looks like Einstein. Yeah, Dr. Einstein sizes up the big picture. Mercury, Venus. 
Earth, and I guess this is exhibit all about Earth in here. There's a lot more to this observatory than I thought there to be. Much more. Okay, let's go through the cafe and the gift shop. Here's the gift shop. Cafe level. Oh, we're back up to the same terrace where I came from. So I gotta walk back over to the other hall. So we get to see this again. <laughs> no problem. All the planetarium tickets are seven dollars to get in and there's a line okay so this is the other hall that I didn't show the first astronomical telescope of Los Angeles pretty sure it still works well Wow Tesla coil
telescope. There are so many exhibits here. It's really worth coming to see this place. All right, so this is the East Terrace. Let's check out the parapet promenade. Okay, I just need to sit better. If I need to, I need to move. Okay, I'm going to sit better. Okay, I'm going to sit better. Guess I'll be the first one to find out. No, nope. not open. Thank you. Pictures and then there's most of them has DVR on. Look at my excuse. Let's go this way. All right, so that was the Griffith Observatory. If you enjoyed this video, then please smash the like button for me. Subscribe for some, for some more videos like these. And I will see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.